If we get 100 likes on this video, I will dance for you! One video. This is the Logo History Collab. Enjoy the show, everyone! Hello, YouTube! Welcome to Logo History, where we take a look at what the logo was like over the years. What's going on, Gears? What's going on, Gears? Welcome to episode 12 of Logo History. Hello, YouTube! Welcome to Logo History Entry. Yo, Hello everyone, Yo Boy Joe Crabs here, and welcome back to another episode of Logo History. Hello you guys, welcome to Logo History. Hey guys, it's your boy, Peter John. Welcome to the episode 168 of the Logo History. Hey guys, right here. Hey you guys, it's Ryan from Shitty Boys, and welcome to episode 4 of Logo History. Hi guys, I'm Lucas Arts. Turkey isn't here because he got a little bit tired of making them inside to start a trend. You know, logos doing logo history for logo history collab videos. And this is episode 6, aka the, my first logo history for logo history collab video. Yeah. Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Logo History. Hey guys, Special Bluish here, and welcome to Reboot Logo History 2. Welcome to the episode 3 of Logo History, episode 2 of Logo History. And for this episode, we are doing Nick Jr. Productions. We're gonna have a look at Nick Jr. Productions. And for this episode, we are taking a look at Nick Jr. Productions. Today, we're going to talk about Nick Jr. Productions. So today, in this logo history, number four we'll be doing Nick Jr. Productions. For this episode, we have Nick Jr. Productions. Today I'm going to talk about Nick Jr. Productions. I hope you like it. So we're going to do Nick Jr. Productions as seat speed recorded because um, I'm watching a premiere and I cannot even find the paper that I used. So we're going to use skin. Today, we're going to look at Nick Jr. Nick Jr. Productions slash other. Today, the logo is Nick Jr. Productions. Today we take a look at Nick Jr. Productions. For this episode, we're doing Nick Jr. Productions. Nick Jr. Productions was a, the television arm of Nick Jr. And it lasted from 1993 all the way up to 2009. This logo can still be seen on the Nick Jr. channel, but not often. Nick Jr. Productions was a television arm from Nick Jr. That's from 1993 all the way up to present. This logo can still be seen on the Nick Jr. This logo can be seen on the Nick Jr. What is Nick Jr. exactly? Nick Jr. Productions is a television production, and actually, Nick Jr. was my childhood show, too. Uh, is a television production arm of Nick Jr. founded in 1993. 
in February 2009, the Nick Jr. Productions brand was folded into the television production arm of Nickelodeon as Nick Jr. was rebranded as Nickelodeon's Playdate at the same time. So let me know if, if I should do a logo history of Nickelodeon and Nickelodeon's Playdate. I'm not sure if it's the same thing or not, but just let me know. I will do it for you. It was a production company founded in 1993. It was owned by Nick Jr. It was defunct and it was defunct in 2009. Nick Jr. Productions is a production company making shows for Nick Jr. when it was blocked from 1999 to 2009 until Nick Jr. became a channel in 2009 and replaced Snoggin. Yeah. So it was founded in 1993 and was ended in 2009. Nichiro Productions started in 1993. In 2009, it was rebranded to Nichiro Originals. Anyways, without further ado, let's start. Anyways, without further ado, let's start. I'm going to talk about Nick Jr. Productions. So here's the logo. And now, without further ado, let's get start it. Anyways, let's begin with LucasArts Nick Jr. Productions logo history. So without further ado, let's get started. 1993 to 2000, we have the orange stick figure that has the word Nick and the little blue stick figure that has the word Junior on it, which is like, like I showed you earlier. Similar to the previous slide, we have and, and, and it has a byline. It says, Gola Gola Island and Nick Jr. Blah, 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 blah. And we have the two stick figures with the slogan, Grow, Learn, and Play. And we have copyright 1994 Nickelodeon. We have the two stick figures in the black background. And also with the byline saying, 2000, copyright 2000 Viacom International Incorporated, all rights reserved. 1993 to 2000, we have the two stick figures, again, in the white background, and we had them in the two. So, so, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm just the person who ever says, what was, what says, go, 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 says, go, 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 Now, this is the first time I've been talking, growing, and playing, and I'm going to just cover right now, and I'm going to you. Now, we have Simmy's and Alka. Mark Brown. Now, we have the win. 1993 to 2000, there's the Nick Jr. logo, the old one, and inside the black, black screen. Now, to 1993 to 2000, we have a little tune. When was Nick Jr. created? Well, it was created in 1988. Its program, its programming consisted of original series, acquired shows and series also aired on the Nick Jr. block. The channel was launched on February 2nd, 1999. So that was basically when probably when my mom and dad got married, I think. So, its shows were originally aimed at preteens. Sorry about the phone. Though it became a preschool children's channel in 2002. And Nick Jr. was actually my childhood show. It, well, I'm not going to ruin it. Um, they had an old name, and I'm not going to ruin it for you. So, you will find out. 1993 to 2000. We have the stick, the two stick, the, we have the next year logo, and we have the byline. Nineteen ninety three to two thousand nine. There are two characters, one orange and one blue, and on them there are the words Nick and J R in white text. Here is an intro. <laughs> We have, um, the, um, Famous Father and Son logo. I'm on the Wikipedia page. So, 1993 to 2000. 
We have a big orange stick figure has the word Nick, and the blue blue stick figure has the word Junior on it, which is like I showed you on episode one. So we are to the previous slide. We have a byline, which is seen all episodes of Gogo Island, and it says Gogo Island and Nick Jr. are, are trademarks of Icon International Incorporated, copyright 1995 Icon. And we have a two stick figures with the Smoking Glow, Word and Play, and we have copyright 1994 Nick Williams. We have the two stick figures in the back background, and also the byline saying copyright 2005 come international incorporated always reserved. Also, also we're just seen at the end of the new little bear, new little bear videos, which is seen at the opening of the Blue Big Musical 2000 features. We just have the old Nick Jr. logo, which is the work, which is uh, two guys, one orange and one blue. And inside the orange guy, there's the word Nick. And inside the blue guy, there's the word Jr. So 1993 to 2009, it's literally the same as the Nick Jr. logo from the time. The orange, the blue stick man off the text Nick and Jr. on it. I just said chain lock. 1993 to 2000. We have the two stick figures on a white background. The big stick figure orange has the word Nick. The little stick figure blue has the word Junior. This little byline that reads Gogo Island and Nick Junior are trademarks of Icon or National Incorporated. There's a copyright notice that I can only read from it. Copyright 1995 Viacom. And this is where on the top, on top of the stick figures, we have the words grow, learn, and play in green, violet, and purple text. And on the bottom, we have copyright 94, 1994 Nickelodeon in yellow text. We had the two stick figures on the black background, and also with the byline saying 2000, copyright 2000, Viacom or National Incorporated, our rights are served. 1993 to the boss. Here's a this is where we start to see different versions of the Nick Jr. Productions logo. We have the two stick figures. We also have them hugging, skipping, jumping. Here's one with birds, bears, cats. Chickens, crocodiles, dinosaurs, dogs, ducks, elephants, um, fish, frogs, giraffes, hippos, kangaroos, lions, monkeys, penguins, pigs, porcupines, rabbits, roosters, swans, turtles. Alternating version of the monkey logo with with a different with a byline on that. Alternating version of the hippos with a different byline. Alternating version of the pigs with a different byline, and and an, and another version of the elephants, which is seen on 
all episodes of Oswald. 1996 to 1999. This was you and Blue's Clues. So we have. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. 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 Run, skip it. Running. Mm, jumping. Birds. Bears. Kangaroo. Cats. Roosters. Cockadiles. Dinosaurs. Cats. Roosters. Bears. Fish. Frogs. Giraffes. Bears. Kangaroos. Dark lions, monkeys, penguins, hippos, porcupines, kangaroos, roosters, swans, seals, dinosaurs, dinosaurs, Okay, did you know Erika's Castle was the first Nick Jr. original series? Cool. Noggin. So Noggin was my childhood show. Noggin was like the f like was the first name before they changed it to like Nick Nigolian or something like that. Nick. I uh, I was gonna say there's another. Wait, I, I'm just gonna continue. Noggin has been launched in 1999 as a channel for preteens. Mhm. Mm the URL with Pritchel Pr was first was the first Nick, Nick Jr. spinoff. Hmm. I haven't heard of that show. And the Backyard Against that was also my childhood TV show. One of my favorite ones was based on a live action pilot from 1998. Maggie and the Ferocious Beast. Okay, okay. This is another one of my favorite childhood TV shows. It was one of my favorite ones. And sad that it's not on anymore. Because I wish I could just go watch it and then look back at the good times. Maggie and the, and the Ferocious Beast and Ubi. Ooh, oh my god. All of these childhood TV shows were my favorite. I shouldn't even have to say it again. And Ubi bege for, both began as a series of shorts. Mm -hmm. I don't know how many minutes, but it was shorts. Dora the Explorer is the longest running TV. Um, not TV. Well, it is. Um, it's on TV. Nick Jr. series to date. So that's really interesting. 1996, 2004. This is we have the same thing, but the screen is black instead of white. Tom, why these bearings were seen in the ending episodes of Blue's Clues? If, if one if one if one variant was of this logo was seen in episode Oswald in episode. Ten. So in 1996 to 1999, there are lots of variants. So I've been, so six of these. That's one, that's two, that's three, that's four, that's five, and that's six. 1996 to 2004, this is where we start to see different versions of the Nick Jr. production of Marco. We should see seasons one of three episodes of Blue's Clues. So, so we have the byline, and it says copyright 1996 by Com International Incorporated, and so we have a hand holding. <laughs> Thank you.
1996 to 1999 in the show called Blue's Clues, we have the old Nick Jr. logo, and under it, there's a Viacom byline that reads, Copyright 1996 Viacom International Inc. Now, there are a lot of variants for this logo, so we, we only picked three. Actually, I only picked three. The first variant we have is skipping. As you can see, it has the guy skipping instead of do their normal pose. The second variant we got is running, where the blue guy and the orange guy are running. This is only seen in the United Kingdom. So, and our final variant has an orange and a blue monkey. An orange monkey and a blue monkey. Instead of the guys, but they still have the word Nick and the word Junior inside of them, respectively. And also the copyright. I lied from Viacom. 1996 to 2004, this is where we get to see different versions of the Nick Junior Productions logo. So, we have the two stick figures, and on the bar it says, Copyright 1996 by Color National Incorporated. These are the stick figures they made play date, so we also have them hugging, skipping, jumping. Here's one with birds, bears, cats, chickens, lizards, dinosaurs, dogs, ducks, elephants. Fish, frogs, giraffes, hippos, kangaroos, lions, monkeys, penguins, pigs, porcupines, or hedgehogs, rabbits. Here's an alternative version without the byline. Roosters, swans, turtles. Seals, snakes, here's the snakes in the white background, bats, here's also the bats with a white background. Alternate version of the monkeys with a different byline of their... Alternate version of the monkeys with free copyright infos. Alternating version of the turtles with a different byline. Alternating version of the lions with a different byline. Alternating version of the hippos with a different byline. Alternating version of the ducks with a different byline. Alternating version of the pigs with a different byline. Alternating version of the humans with a different byline. Or people, of course. Alternating version of the stick figures with a different byline. And an R version of the elephants, which was seen on all episodes of Oswald. 1996 to 1999 books. Here's the Nick Jr. black text. Here's the handle. <laughs> okay, skip it. Jumping. Running. Bird. And bears, bears, cats, chicken, crocodile, dinosaurs, dogs, dogs, elephants, fish, frogs, giraffes, hippos, kangaroos, lions, monkeys, penguins, pigs, birdlings. Rabbits, roosters, swans, wolves, seas, toddlers, elephants, or marginals. Chain on blue screws, my get the ghost on the way to Bosphia. This is not going to be the way to Bosphia. 
VHS. Now this one is a classic here, 1999 to 2009. Um, we it seems that it seems that. The stick figures have turned into clay. We have the stick figures that have Nick Jr. on it, and um, we have productions. This little byline that has little Bill, blah, 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 blah. This is seen on all episodes of Little Bill. And also seen on all episodes of Little Bill, we have. This purple byline, copyright, copyright 2001, Viacom International Incorporated. 1999 to 2009. We have the word This is now his byline. Copyright. I got This is This is Now it is a rare version. The word production has been added in rainbow text with some stuff on it. And now it's on, and now the logo is more 3D or, and hugging each other, and now it's in a yellow background. 1999 to 2009, we had the stick figures with the, or Nick Jr., and we had the word productions. Alright, 1999 to 2009. This is from 1999 to 2009 episodes of Dork. Two, two thousand two thousand nine episodes. Don't know four. Two thousand two thousand four episodes of Blues Blues. Two thousand two thousand two two thousand three episodes of the Bear. Oh, episodes of Azul and two thousand four and two thousand five episodes of the Bad Guys. Damn, same. This is seen on all episodes of Little Bill. This is the very. This is a rare one used. In, this is the rare one. And it was seen in 1999, as you can tell here. So, that was a rule, because you see, 1999. Copyright 1999, Viacom International Inc. Now, th this one is classic, uh, 1999. It was changed to Nick Jr. Nick Production, so we have uh, 1999 to February 2nd to 2009. Okay, so Nick Jr. Nick Jr. Productions ended in to, to 2009. Uh, before its own Nick, Nick Jr. channel came out, Nick Jr. Productions ended. So, we have the order stick figures. The, this is the clay logo. And so, and so, wait, we other words, productions in, in purple, orange, and green, uh, uh, blue, and, and, uh, and these straight colors, and inside the eye, there is a heart on the other eye, and this is the, and this is the by, and, and this is the purple byline, which is seen all episodes of with the bell. It says with the bell and all the logos, titles, and characters are trade marks of Funcom International Incorporated. And, and and the second byline saying copyright 2001 Funcom International Incorporated. And this is the different Nick Jr. Productions logo scene in 1999, just where the show of the Little Bill started. If you want to see on YouTube, click into somebody's channel in the in the description box below. So we are the artistic figures. 
uh, and about the productions and an insane copyright 1999 if I come in copyright 1999 2009 we have the old Nick Jr. logo but it's made out of clay and under we have the word productions in loads of different colors these two the logo the logo made out of clay and the word productions are inside this yellow and bright green background. Here is the first frame of a variant from the show Little Bill. And this is the other variant from Little Bill that has the 2001 Firecom byline. And this is an Rare logo from 1999 that has the old Nick Jr. logo, which is just the old Nick Jr. logo and not made out of clay. And under there, we have the word productions in black. And we also have the word, and we also have the background copyright byline. 1999 to 2009. This is where this is the white. And yellow saturation background. So wait, it seems that the stick figures have turned into clay. So we have the two stick figures that has the word Nick Jr. And on the bottom we have the word Productions. This will byline that reads Will will and all related logos, tiles, and characters are trademarks of Viacom International Incorporated. This was seen on all episodes of Will Bell. And also seen on all episodes of Little Bill, we have copyright 2001 by Color National Incorporated, all rights reserved. 1999 to 2009, here is the Nick Moodle, seen on the 299 episode of Thor 2, two episodes of Thor 2 exploded, for example, episode of Blue Schools, Nick Jr. and Space Train, episodes of Little Bear, and all episodes of Ufo, and the two balls, all five episodes of Mark Guys. First night, see all the episodes of Little Ball. Tell the variant with Little Bill. Bill. A real Nick Jr. production logo, written in 1999. 2004, we have the two frogs that have Nick Jr. on it. We have the word productions on it. This was featured in the Dora the Explorer special, Dora's Pirate Adventure. It premiered on January 27th of 2004. 2004, and then we had to wear Nick Jr. on 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 to wear on January 24 and 2004. 2004. These are just frogs, and then in the bottom there's word production. And uh, white text and side of green. Um, screen. The reason why this is just for a, a door movie. 2004. Yeah, the frogs with the word Nick Jr. and the word productions. This was only used in the Thor the Explorer part movie. I wish they used this logo for other stuff. But too bad they only use it for one for one movie. This is very interesting to report on the premiere of Doy's Fire Adventures on the 27th of January 2004. January 20. 26, 2004, we have the two frogs that, we have a Nick Jr. frogs, and the word production on it, this was seen on George Power the Picture, which is either a fox logo or the, or the clay logo. It was premiered on January 26th or 27th of 2004. 2004, for Doris Pirates Adventure premiering, we have the word Nick, which is inside the orange frog, and the word Junior, which is inside the uh, blue frog, and it's on the bottom there's the word production. 
The orange rock, blue rock, and the working dark start beside the screen background. Two balls and four from the race Pirate Dimension. Only seen on the premiere of the Pirate Dimensions, January 7th, with TV, VHS, and DVD. The previous logo. And this is also a classic. Um, 2005 to 2009, we have the two stick figures. They're now 3D now. He can improve the animation. And it seems to... And, and there it seems to have a puddle in it. And in the puddle we have the word productions. And we also have the byline that... that whatever it says. This was featured in 10 Years of Blue. 2005, 2009, we had the two figures. We're not reading now. And we have the And finally, we have the byline. Two thousand and five to two thousand and nine. Now they're just hugging each other, and there's a pink splat thing, and the side, there's word productions and my text, and inside it's blue and green background. Channels related to Nick Jr. and I just said this noggin. It doesn't exist anymore because it got renamed to Nickelodeon, Nick Jr. Whatever. Nickelodeon, T Nick, and Nick at Night. So basically, Nick at Night, it like, there's a ch channel called Nick at Night, at night time, basically, throughout the night. <laughs> so, yeah. 2005 to 2009, we have the puddle, and we have the word, we have the two stick figures, and the puddle with the word productions. In 2009, it was defunct, along with Noggin. This scene from 2005 to 2009, like Contender and even Eidos. So here it is. So, just here. See now, 2005 to 2009 episodes of Guardian Eagle. 2006 to 2009 episodes of Warner Pets. 2005 to 2009 episodes of Dora the Explorer. Because, you know, as I told you, I don't think I told any of you. The Wonder Pets lasted from 2006 all the way to 2016. I think. Like, Deluxe. Which I'll be doing for episode 156. Right after, uh, Minimax. So. To expect this episode of Blue's Room, which is a old, this is this old so, show. Two as my interest in episodes of the Bad Guardians. And 2008-2009 episodes of the New How High Lands, I think it's out of the Oh, this is seen on all 2009 episodes of Goldie Egg Go. One of the Good Explore, New How High Land, always having the Nickelodeon light bulb logo. And look, Logopedia spelled bulb wrong. Changing it to blog. What is a blog logo? The Begarigans are at are having a variant of that later. This is seen on uh, Behind the Clues 10 Years of Blue. I think in 2006. This is also classic. Uh, 2005 to February 2nd, 2009. We, we have the two stick figures. They're now 3D now. The important information. This is the puddle logo. Which is seen three, three different versions of the music, which is seen at the at the end of the premiering shows, and so we have two stick figures. They're like uh, different. They're now 3D now, and so we have the word productions in white text, and and there's a the and also. This is in the like the water or the bubble background. Yeah, yeah. 2005 to 2009, we have a 3D old Nick Jr. logo, and it's and the orange guy is standing on a puddle. Inside the puddle, there's some word productions, which is all in a blue and green gradient background. Here is a variant from Behind the Clues, 10 Years of Blue, to celebrate 10 years, the 10 years anniversary of Blue's Clues. 
2005 to 2009. This is where we get to see different versions of the two stick figures. We have the two stick figures hugging, and on the bottom, it seems to have a purple puddle in it with yellow drops. And in the paw, we have the word productions. And it's also surrounded by this aquamarine background with different green and blues. And we also have the byline that whatever it says. 2008 Viacom International Incorporated, All Rights Reserved. Nick Jr., 10 years with blue and All Rights Reserved. 10 years with blue and All Related Tiles. Logos and characters are trademarks of Viacom International Incorporated, All Rights Reserved. So. This was featured in 10 Years of Blue. Two balls and five, two balls and nine. Can you see that? The two balls and nine dab, episodes of Go Diego Go. In today's night episode of Wonder Bros. Find two balls and nine dab, episode of Lord of the Explorers. In the episode of Blue's Room. In five episodes of Light Guardians. In the last eight months and nine episode of Lena, your like and ten or twelve nine episodes of your. Go, Wonder Pets, Pets, Dirty Explorer, Nihayo Lager, Always have the Nicolette and your iBiz logo, the Bog Gander, so the very famous logo. See you only on the big screen. 10 years of blue. 2009 to the present, we have the current Nick Jr. logo, and on the bottom we have the word productions in green text, and it's surrounded by this white background. Similar to the previous logo, we have the word originals instead of the word productions. Anyways, that is all for now. Thank you so much for watching episode 18 of Logo History. So I'll see you tomorrow. If not, I'll see you on Sunday. Stay tuned for episode 19. Nick Tunes, T Nick, yeah, yeah, Nick yeah, and Knight, yeah, yeah. Nick Mom, and Nick Music. Bye bye. <laughs> And I'll see you after the rest of the day. Stay tuned for episode 13. The tunes, teen, the tunes. Stay tuned for episode 13. The tunes, teen, Nick, Nick and I, Nick Mom, and they use it. Bye-bye. Yeah. I think this is it. Viewers. So, thank you guys so much for watching. So make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. Turn on post notifications so you won't miss a video. Thank you for... Uh, going to go back. So thank you for NFL Fan 65 so we, for requesting. And if you want to want more logo histories, please make sure to subscribe and comment down requests below. So yeah, I just started doing these... For like after like almost a year ago. Jeez. But anyways. Thank you for watching. And I will see you guys in the next one. Goodbye everyone. Anyways. Well, thank you so much for watching this episode of Logo History. And I will see you tomorrow for a brand new episode. Stay tuned for episode 4. PBS Kids, Universal Kids, and PBS Kids Go. Bye for now. Okay guys, this is it for today. I really hope you liked it. Stay tuned for episode 169 that is going to be about Panasonic, Canal Uno, Pocket Watch and Ryan's World. And also don't forget to join my Discord server and to subscribe to my channel so you can watch all my videos. I am Peter John, this is Logo History and until Tuesday, bye. And that's it, although Nick Jr. Originals has a little bit of in there. But we don't do that. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you guys later. Goodbye. Hey, hey, Zeebo. Alright, that's all for now, guys. Thank you so much for watching this episode 4 of Logo History. And I'll see you tomorrow for episode 5. Stay now. Now, stay, stay tuned for two, sor two sorts. That are closed on March 14, 2018 due to, due to 
Big Lossy, Toys R Us, uh, my, uh, my, uh, my, my childhood, and, and my brother's childhood toy store, and, and, and babies of us, four for the babies. Bye for now. LucasArts Films, LucasArts, Nick Jr. Productions, Logo History. Stay tuned for episode 10, which, stay tuned for episode 7, which is going to be revealed after Rob Gio 0407 l reveals it on his post. Bye for now! <laughs> All right, that's it for now, guys. Thank you so much for watching Reboot Logo History 2. Don't forget to request another logo in the comment section below. And I'll see you later for another episode, guys. Goodbye. Okay, that's it for this episode. Stay tuned for the next episode. Seven up. Feel this time. Goodbye. Okay, guys. It's safe for the episode 15 of the episode of episode 50 of logo history is about channel 4 bye hey there guys robert here thank you so much for watching this episode of the logo history collab please be sure to be on the lookout for the next episode on ragdoll productions please note that if you are a youtuber that mainly does logo history videos and you already did a logo history video on ragdoll productions please let me know in the comments so you can potentially be a part of the next episode also, I'm only accepting 15 users for the collab, so let me know in advance before your spot gets taken away. Also, please don't forget to subscribe to the channel with notifications turned on so you don't miss a single video from me, as we're on the road to 4,000 subs. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye, everyone. No!